Here, many Spirit Airlines passengers at the uh, hub in Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International Airport and elsewhere have been hearing that for nearly a week. So what exactly is going on and when do the flight cancellations end? CBS 4's Austin Carter is live at FLL with the latest. And Austin, you spoke to someone who is a living travel nightmare. Yeah, he really is actually spending the night inside the airport. Now, here is what's happening. The Spirit CEO says that they should have canceled more flights due to a staff shortage, but instead they tried to meet demand. And now passengers, especially here at FLL, a hub for Spirit, they were left to scramble and some did have to stay inside the airport like this man. A lot of people just nervous and they just decided to, to buy another plane ticket. But as I, I don't have anybody here. For a sixth day in a row, confusion and frustration in the terminal. The arrival and departure boards at Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International Airport filling with canceled and delayed Spirit Airlines flights. And I've been waiting a long time. And a long time indeed, well past the 24 hour mark for Robert Jerome, who flew into Fort Lauderdale on Thursday from Haiti. He's trying to get to friends in Ohio. And I knew that I was going to spend the night in Ohio, not at the airport. That was. That's going crazy. He found out he'd be spending the night inside the airport around 2 in the morning. He says a hotel stay was not given, his jacket becoming a makeshift pillow. I just use it on the floor and sleep on it on the floor. How many hours of sleep do you think you got? Uh, maybe he two and a half hours. But the airline CEO, Ted Christie, tells CBS News that they are doing everything they can to accommodate passengers. It's heart-wrenching. Uh, it's a terrible experience, and we're doing our best uh, to make up for that, and I believe we have, so that those people are either where they belong, where they're in a hotel, or, or afforded the option to go somewhere else. CBS News has learned that more than 250 flights were canceled Friday, and more than 1,700 flights have been canceled since Sunday. Okay, and these delays and cancellations have been going on for almost a week, especially here in Fort Lauderdale. The CEO of Spirit believes things will get back to normal by the middle of next week. Elliot.